bumble bear. Once there was a bear called Norman who loved honey. He really, really loved it. And he was always sad when it ran out. But getting hold of more honey was always a bit tricky. If only I could be a bee, he sighed. I could have as much honey as I liked. And then Norman had a quite amazing and brilliant idea. It was an ordinary morning at bee school. Hello bee, said the queen bee, who was in charge. We have a new bee at bee school today. Ooh, said the little bees. Everyone say hello to Norman. Hello Norman, ooh, said the little bees. Aren't you a bit big? asked Amelia, who was a rather clever little bee. Uh, um, I'm a special bee, said Norman. I come from a land far, far away called Giant Bee Land, hmm, said Amelia. But then it was time for lessons to start. Bee School Daily Planner, name Norman. They began the day with some painting. Then Norman joined in with some buzzing practice before everyone settled in for a nap. The bee showed him all sorts of games during playtime and Norman was a brilliant at waggly dancing. Bee school is amazing, thought Norman. He couldn't wait to come back the next day. The next morning was even better. Norman was very good at finding smelly flowers. The bees really liked him, even during flying lessons. He was so funny and funny and he always tried his best. After lunch, the bees learned how to chase everyone away who came for their honey, like spiders, mice, toads or bears. Amelia still felt like there was something a bit odd about Norman. He tried, she tried to work out what it was. <gasps> bears! Amelia told other bees what she had found out. But they didn't believe her. Of course Norman is a bee. Just look at him. He's not a bee and I shall prove it, said Amelia. She took Norman to the bees. Well, when he saw all the honey, Norman just couldn't help himself. Honey, 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 honey. After all, he really, really loved honey. See, Norman isn't a bee. He is a bear, said, Am said Amelia. What the jiggins, gasped all the little bees. Hmm, said Norman. He was asked to leave at once. With Norman gone, things were very, very quiet at bee school. Norman was such a funny bee, sighed the bees. Norman was such a busy bee, sighed Amelia. Norman was a naughty bear, said the Queen. A naughty... And, and bee school is no place for bears. But later that night, he heard a loud crash. A diabolical Oh no, they called. It's a bear. And this bear was big, nasty, and trampled all over bee school. It grabbed the hive and started to shake it. The bees turned out in a panic. They tried to chase away the bear, but it was just too big and bad. But then, a fearsome, buzzing beast burst through the trees. Buzz! Eek! squeaked the bear. It's a giant bee! And ran away as fast as he could. The bees were saved, and Norman was a hero. They gave him a big pot of honey, and the queen presented him with a special award. You definitely aren't a bee, said the Queen, but you're no ordinary bear. You think I no you are, I think, a bumble bear. Mm. And bumble bears are definitely allowed to go back to bee school. The end. I hope you enjoyed that video that I hope you enjoyed that book and I hope to see you next time. Goodbye.